Hello again, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today I'm here at King Shaka Airport, International Airport, down in Durban in South Africa, and I'm going to be flying up to Johannesburg. I'm going to be using Fly Safair, which is a low cost carrier that is based in South Africa. Interestingly, though, the parent company uh, is called Safair and they're based in Dublin. You wouldn't think there'd be any low cost carriers coming out of Ireland, would you? Apparently the parent company is one of the biggest operators of civil Hercules aircraft in the world. They do a lot of uh, relief work. Uh, as I say, it's a low cost carrier, so not expecting too much, but hopefully we'll see it. The check-in process and booking process has been pretty simple so far. So we'll see how it goes. Why don't you come along? King Shaka Airport looks modern and well kept, although there wasn't any water supply due to the significant floods the month before which had damaged the area's infrastructure. They managed to keep the airport operational, moving barrels of water around on trolleys. The airport was very quiet. I expect it gets busier later in the day when the international flights are getting ready to leave. And once airside, there were a few shops, a couple of cafes and a bar. Not too much, but enough, I think. There's also a biltong stall with a wide variety of meats to choose from. It looked lovely. Boarding was from gate 10 onto our ride today, a Boeing 737-800. This one was painted in the Springbok colours as Fly Safair are the official domestic carrier for the South African rugby team. Boarding was from both ends. They filtered us out on the jet bridge by seat number and I was sent to the back. Hello, how are you? Good evening. Thank you, Janice. Sorry? Thank you, Yes, yes. I, I hope you are. Yeah, hopefully, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> they did allow people who couldn't make the stairs to board from the front. But that seemed to pass this guy by as he shoved past an old lady who was trying to get to the back row. Consideration cost nothing. And immediately grab an oxygen mask, pulling it firmly toward you. It is the action of pulling the mask toward your face. As you can see, legroom is fantastic. I'm impressed with that. Over your nose and mouth and continue to breathe normally. Safe air flight from Durban up to Johannesburg. Uh, boarding was a little bit chaotic. We were going down the jet bridge and then they split us, asking for your road number so you could go on from the back. I went on from the back, so I've got a nice shot of the plane that we went on. Uh, catering on here because it's a low cost airline, it's buy on board, but it's really not very expensive. Uh, I was just looking, I'm not buying anything. But uh, you can get a, a beer for 25 rand, which is just over a pound, which is all right. It's cheap enough on a plane. And there are snacks and things like that. I was thinking about get, getting a biltong pack, a little bit of biltong and a beer. But uh, it's a bit early in the afternoon for that, because I've still got the rest of the day to go. And I'll be finished when I get to Johannesburg after a, a round of beers and biltong. So uh, yeah, it seems, it seems quite all right. It's beautiful outside, the weather's nice, sunny, really warm in Durban, a bit cooler in Johannesburg, um, but we should be getting there pretty much on time. Well, the safety car. 
card in the back of the seat. Uh, it's a pretty full flight as well. So they're doing all right. Okay, my willpower snapped and I went for the beer and biltong. What I didn't know was that Uncle Joe made biltong, as well as his world famous mint balls from Wigan. It was delicious. We're on our descent into Joburg, um, flew, up, flew up here from Durban on uh, Fly Sapphire. Uh, pretty uneventful flight, really. Uh, it's been quite comfortable though, the seats are all right. They're not too bad, plenty leg room so you're not crammed in like a sardine. The buy on board is a bargain. It's uh, yeah, brilliant. We'll be on the ground in about five or six minutes and on time, which is all you can ask for. I think it cost me 37 pounds for this flight, which is okay. It's an hour flight, 37 quid, uh, in relative comfort. Yeah, they're good. They are good for a low cost carrier. This was a very comfortable flight on a competent carrier that is getting a good name for itself down here in South Africa. Don't be put off by the fact that they're low cost. The seats are good, the food is good, well the biltong is. And they got me to my destination on time. Polite golf clap to fly Sapphire. They did a good job. And there we are. Many thanks for joining me today on this fly Sapphire flight from Durban to Joburg. I hope you enjoyed it. Please do subscribe as it will help me start generating funds to keep on doing this. And the good thing is, it doesn't cost you a penny. And while you're there, hit the alert bell so you know when I post new videos. Thanks again, and I'll see you on the next one.